What up, what up? It's Neighborhood and Lip Puzzle. We right here at Salazar. Y'all tuned in to wrap up sound bites. For the king, talk to me. That's bomb. My five bucket list attendees at a round table dinner. I say number one would be Quincy Jones. Reason being just his, his, the distance he's covered as a human coming from like Chicago in the 30s, you know, poverty, to being the producer on the world's highest selling album in history. He's got a dope perspective, I think. You know what I'm saying? I just, I just think he's like a dope point of view. Dead or alive, I would have to say number two would be Albert Einstein. I would like to just chop with him. He might not have been the most social person, but you know, fool brings the festivity out of people. Nikolai Tesla, I think he's somebody that has a, a unique perspective. Tupac, I always love how Tupac expressed his point of views. I always thought he always was fully informed and he had a, had a deep opinion. Whether you agree with it or not, you know what I'm saying? He was somebody that was like super passionate and super intelligent to me. We need some girls at the dinner, man. We don't need all men at the dinner. Who else is there? Oprah Winfrey. Have Oprah at the table with us, you know what I mean? She came from Chicago also, and you know, had a rough childhood, and just um, overcame all the odds. And you know, was able to just create something massive. And she real true to her story. She's somebody that I think is genuine, and um, just has a, a unique perspective also. My dinner cracking, right? <laughs>